Hey everybody, welcome back to Going Ballistic. Sorry we haven't shot a video in a week or so. We were out at Edwin Sarkissian's place doing some videos with them last week, him and Jasper E. Really, really cool guys. Make sure you guys check his channel out for the videos that we did together. It was a lot of fun. Well, we are back out on our range and we are back at it. So we had one of our subscribers say, hey, it'd be cool to do a test with a frozen toilet paper, wet toilet paper, and a dry toilet paper, or something along that lines. And I thought, eh, it's kind of a cool video, but me and my bum um, are really good friends with toilet paper, so I didn't want to shoot that. So what we did is we thought, well, you know, go big or go home, right? So, so what we got is we got these big brown paper towel rolls, the ones that's in the dispensers and stuff. We thought, let's, let's you know, get a bigger target, uh, a bigger roll, and, and try that idea out. So what we got, last night I, I sat there and my wife wasn't too happy because these really frosted over our whole freezer, but we got some of these and they are s frozen solid as, as much as my little freezer would get them. We do have some that are are completely soaked, soaking right now in the water. Make sure it's nice and soaked. And then we got dry ones. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna shoot three rounds at each one. So what we got are some of my favorite rounds, the 223 ball round. Then we're gonna step it up to the 556 green tip. And we're gonna see how the 556 EP round does on these things. So what we're gonna do is Justin's just gonna boom, 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 each one. We'll see how each one does and we'll check it out. And I, I know you, some of y'all are thinking, wow, what a really boring video. You gotta hang around to the end, okay? And here's why. Cause I'm not gonna show you the tip of this bullet, but if you guys remember when we shot the two inch AR, we pulled out um, a special made round for us called a zebra round. Now, yeah, the casing's just painted and it's got little zebra stripes on it to make it pretty, but I'm holding the tip here because I don't want to show it to you guys. But anyways, we're going to shoot it with this at the end. We're going to pile them all up and show you the power of these rounds. This is the last one I got. I don't know if we can get any others made. Um, hopefully we can because these things pack a punch. They hit and explode. Not really great for penetrating, but man, they explode good. So you guys got to stick around. You're going to love this zebra round. Anyways, that's enough of me. Quick word from our sponsor. Do you need a break? Do you desire to kick back for just a few minutes and blow some stuff up? Well, this new game, Mech Arena, is the game for you. It's a new casual mobile shooter game and it's great for just picking up and blowing off some steam. Hop in and play a game or two, cause some mayhem, and be out in just a few minutes. Life is good. Mech Arena is great for long range and up close fighting and any mech can succeed here. Just keep to the edges if you're not ready for the center. If you're in the Forbidden City, make sure you can fight long range. A great tactic is to jump around on the rooftops with Lancer. The other team never expects attacks from above. I love all the arenas. All were well designed from ice to desert, everything in between. There are loads of events happening in the game right now. All the way through the month where you can get a bunch of awesome weapons including Mech Arena's hottest new weapon, the Disc Launcher. On top of that, there's also a ton of special Halloween events to take part in and some extra Halloween skins to win. But the best part of the game is there is a daily login rewards program which you definitely don't want to miss out. Simply log in and claim your prize. It's that easy. Mech Arena is completely free to play on your Android or iOS, so download it right now. And use my personal link down below or scan my QR code and get one desert digital skin 200 A-Coins, and 10,000 credits to help you kickstart your game. You can also add me as a friend and we can blow some stuff up together. So download it today. Thanks a lot. All right, we're back on the range. We got the trusty M16. This thing's semi-famous now since uh, it was in the presence of Edwin Sarkissian. So we're gonna be, I gotta put the mag in the right way. So we're gonna shoot in ball, Green tip, EPR, into the dry paper towel rolls. Let's see what kind of damage we can do. So I'm gonna do it top to bottom.
Clear. All right, as always, good shooting from Justin. Here's the three shots, one, two, three. They're pretty good solid shots. Um, you can see they all went through the first roll. You can see a little bit of the paper towel roll in there in the center. Then here's the second one. One, two, three. And as you can see on the third one here, we do have two holes. I'm thinking that's a ball and a green tip. Um, this was the second one, but it looked like it veered off, uh, as you can see from that carnage right there. And this was faced this way. So the last one peeled off and went that way. But nothing came through even, um, nothing came through the center here, you can see. So, all right, we're gonna dig into it real quick, see if we can find them. Hey, look at that, there's one right there. That, my friend, is the ball round. And this is our green tip. Oh, cool. It will actually stop 556. Five, yep. So that's all you got to do. If you don't have any body armor, just take two of these and stack them in front of you. They'll be a protruding a little bit, but they will stop a 556. Five, um, on to the wet ones. Here we go. <laughs> that sounded funny. All right. So this setup is with the wet paper towels. Same order ball, green tip. EPR. So we're going to do a top to bottom and we're about, I'd say about 20, 20 yards out. All right, ready. All right, ready. Clear. Oh no, my mag is in the dirt. Well, here's where Justin hit. He hit up high here with the uh, ball round, and as you guys could see, it just kind of blew out the top. So nothing in the second one, but here is the second shot. That'd be green tip and then the EP round. And the back side, they both blew right through the wet ones. And into the second it went. Okay but no exits. And if you look here in the center, I don't know if you could see that down there, Justin, we can kind of see that it, it pushed only about halfway through, if you could see. Casting a hell of a shadow. Okay, never mind. Anyways, if you look down this way, you cannot see through. And uh, it looks like it went about halfway through. So give us a sec, we'll cut this one open, see what they look like. You wouldn't think cutting water would be difficult. Hey man, you know, Chuck Norris could do it. Check that out. This is the first time we have recovered actually the full EP projectile. So that's pretty cool, man. So this, the EP was the second one. Well, let's see. Cause that's the first. Watch yourself, Justin. Oh, oh, I see some copper. Bam, there it is. No idea, I guess that, was it the green tip? Yeah. The, oh yeah, cause it has a small steel core, but I don't know, let's see if we find, nope, that's it. So somewhere in this mess is the rest of it. All right, well, that was pretty cool. We uh, found the uh, core to the EP round. We've never done that before. And we got one good one that we are going to save for the zebra round. So make sure you stick around for that. You're gonna like it. Okay, frozen ones. So on, on today's science channel, I have a feeling we're gonna discover something new with the frozen paper towels. So same order, same distance. Ready? Ready. <laughs> Clear. Okay, here's the first towel roll. Again, this is, ouch, frozen solid. Nice tight group on this one. Boom, okay, so we got some exit holds. It looks like all three, surprisingly, I, I really thought the frozen was gonna do better. But, second one, right there, one, 
two, three, three holes into the second. And, ooh, look at that. What a find. Okay, so that is the green tip, I believe. It's weird, I've never seen one um, like taken apart or anything, so I honestly can't say. So you guys um, let us know. It looks like this is the green tip one. So that's two of them that are just like each other. Um, the other one's whole, looks like whole, and surprisingly enough, we have two holes in this one, um, and they didn't go halfway. So, the wet ones win. Well, we could not, we dug and the path ended. We have no idea which round that was. It's just, it's gone. It's already started to uh, thaw out on us here. Um, but we could not find it anywhere in here. So, on to the round that you all been waiting for. The famous, mysterious zebra round. You ready, Justin? Ready. <laughs> Let's do it. All right, now it's time for some real destruction. We got our zebra round into all the paper towel rolls. Let's see if there's anything left. You ready, Chris? Ready. There we go. I am the machine. <laughs> Holy crap. <laughs> Knocked my hat off and everything. Oh. Clear. Clear. <laughs> well, that was one heck of a confetti party. And for all you who are going to complain about the trash, this is recycled paper and it'll get recycled back into the earth. So don't panic, okay? All right. Here we go, this was cool. I love those, I absolutely love those zebra rounds. I don't know if we can get any more of those. They were special made. Like I said, they pack a heck of a punch. See the wet ones? The wet ones just keep holding up, Justin. <laughs> well, thank you everybody for watching. We really appreciate it. Check out our Instagram page. Become a patron if you want to help further support this channel. We really appreciate just watching our videos. We really do. Thank you, everybody. We'll be back.